Greg Abbott appears to be committing crimes at the southern border. Let's uncover the truth. Texas Governor Greg Abbott has pulled another one of his cruel and inhumane stunts by shipping migrants from the southern border to Washington, D.C., where he drops off approximately 30 of them on the front lawn of Kamala Harris's doorstep. Let's watch this video and then we will discuss after. This disgusting move by Texas's Republican governor to score points with the anti-immigrant border fanatics may be incriminating as well, at least according to former federal prosecutor Glenn Kirshner, whom, when Ron DeSantis shipped the migrants from the border to Martha's Vineyard, accused DeSantis of, quote, kidnapping by inveiglement because... If Ron DeSantis deceived these migrants into believing that they would be going on a plane to get jobs at Martha's Vineyard or food or housing or shelter, then failed to deliver on that promise when they arrived, is merely kidnapping. He's taking human beings across state lines and deceiving them into doing so. So if Greg Abbott here promised these migrants jobs, housing, shelter, and then failed to provide it for them once they arrived in DC, which it appears he has, then this is also kidnapping by inveiglement. By the way, this is the federal law that Governor DeSantis and Governor Abbott may have violated through this egregious political stunt. Regardless of what happens to them criminally, this should not be used as a political tool. These are human beings with families, with children, with relationships, with dreams, who have come to this country to pursue a better life. And now, leaders of the Republican Party are weaponizing them to score points with their radicalized followers. This is not how we should behave as a country, and these acts should be investigated by federal authorities immediately. <laughs> 